Hey everybody, this is Jeremiah Craig and I'm joined once again by my beautiful wife, Brenna. She is vital to this video because we have an Ariat Women's Western Wear Gift Guide video for all you folks out there getting ready for the holidays. What do you think about that? I think if you're looking for something for that special female in your life, I think we got some options. Or if you ladies want to get something for yourself. Or, hey! <laughs> Let's get into it. Old boots got soul, and I carry on this way, and we get better every day. All right, Brenna, so this is a sponsored video. Ariet reached out to us and asked us if we would do a gift guide video for them and of course we said yes. So they sent us a bunch of stuff to show you on their gift guide part of their website and they got a bunch of stuff there. So if you're interested in any of this stuff, you should definitely go check it out and see what else they have. Mm -hmm. But let's start out with the vest, I think. It seems like a good place to start. Yeah, so this is the first rodeo vest. I liked it because of the color. I thought the uh, the tanny kind of mustard color was really cool. It is really cool. Uh, this retails for $75, which I think is actually a great price once you actually feel the quality of it. Um, so this is just a little simple vest. It has the uh, kind of like brass button closure. It is a cotton and rayon, uh, so you can put it in the wash. It feels really lightweight, too. Yeah, it is really lightweight. I think it's a nice, like, fall, winter kind of layer, um, and I really like the little detail on here, the little um, Thunderbirds. I think that's just, you know, like a nice little touch. Those are cool. Um, and then it does have this, like, nice taffeta lining, which I think is super unique and super fun. It's super soft. Yeah, it is really soft and lightweight. And then on the inside, the graphic, ain't my first rodeo. Yeah, <laughs> which is just cute. Yeah, it's kind of fun knowing that you have something like that on the inside of your vest. Yeah, you'll see me try it on in just one second. Yeah, let's look at the jeans next. <laughs> All right, next up, we have the premium high rise flare jean. I got these in a 27S for short, because I'm real short. Um, and that's equivalent to like a size six, so. Um, these I liked because they have kind of this like flare at the bottom and they do have a rough edge kind of cut so there's no hem. Yeah, they call it their raw cut. Yeah. What do you think about that? I think it's definitely a look. Mm -hmm. I think I like it either more stringy or hemmed. Yeah, I'm sure it'll get stringy <laughs> with age though. Yeah. Since it is that raw cut. Yeah. And it has a, a one a two way stretch, so it does go this way. It doesn't necessarily stretch this way. There's so there's not a ton of stretch to these jeans, so just something to know. This is their rinse color too. I believe mm -hmm. it comes in two colors, like mm -hmm. blue lake and rinse. Yeah. This is a darker color and I think that looks good. You don't have very many darker colored jeans like this. No, I really don't. I have the Luckies and then I have one pair of, I think there are seven Pearl Man Kinds and they're a little bit darker, they're skinny jean, but I'm excited to see how these fit. They look really nice. Um, and I like the little like detail that they have on there, the little A. Should I show them the back? Because a lot of the Ariat jeans have a lot of stitching and you know like little glitter things on the back i don't know what you call them but uh yeah. these have nothing embroidery yeah that's why i like these because the area jeans that we had tried on previously that uh, i think last year or earlier this year they're just a lot mm -hmm. <laughs> it's just not my kind of style like that ed hardy kind of style um but these were a little bit simpler a little bit more for like the everyday i can pair it with whatever i want the look to be instead of the look being me um so yeah i like these i think they're super cool excited to see how these fit not many um folks have a short size so see if that's true size. yeah that's a good thing about area is that they seem to be making lots of different clothes for lots of different sizes yeah i definitely like their be with the boots for men the price on these jeans is 119.95 so a little bit of a pricier jean but i think they got some sales going on so yeah and this is a 10 and a half ounce premium Italian denim. Yep. So that sounds pretty impressive too, and it feels really nice. Yeah, it's got a little bit of stretch to it. Like I said, it does have a two-way stretch, but it's not a four-way stretch, so mm. okay. we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. 
But before we try those on, let's take a look at some boots. These are some sweet boots. They're gonna fit my calf, y'all. Yeah, these are built for uh, ladies with wider calves. They're called the Heritage Elastic Calf Western Boot. And on their website, they said they had a hidden elastic calf. That hidden elastic part is right behind this shaft here. And you can actually see how much it will stretch. And it seems like it is like a wide calf to begin with. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm excited. They have this in two colors. They have this in a black. So this is the black with the brown sole and they do also have it in a brown with a brown sole. I like the black because I thought that the yellow and red detailing was really nice, the stitching. Um, and it is a rubbery plastic sole. This is their bantamweight outsole. Uh -huh. So they have a line of boots that carry the bantamweight outsole and the bantamweight is just really lightweight. When you put these on, I'm sure you'll notice, except it feels like it's a little bit heavier in the heel than those planos were. Yeah. It, that's one thing that I noticed is that uh, the men's boots with the bantamweight were a little bit more balanced, like right in the middle where a lot of boots are a little bit heavier in the heel. This one seems to go that route. Yep. Light up here, but a little bit heavier in the heel. So it still yep. feels pretty light, just a more weighty heel. If you are interested in these boots, you know what you're getting. They are beautiful and they're gonna fit and that's what I'm most excited about, honestly. Yes. <laughs> uh, and for $1.99, it seems like a pretty good deal to me. So yep. I wanna get these on my feet, but wait. But there's one more So piece. we went to the bottom, we gotta go to the top. <laughs> and this is the Aztec beanie and this is Twenty-seven ninety-five, and this is the natural and burlap color. But I just thought it was so cute. It is. It's a little pom pom. This is faux fur up here for it's anybody. Faux fur, curious. and inside it does have a nice fleece. The fleece. Line. You gotta Keep love fleece in the winter. Warm. Yeah, but I just thought it was so cute. Yes. All right. <laughs> yes, you do look so cute. <laughs> Shall yes. you try on the rest of it? Yes. Let's do it. All right, so I have got on the hat, the vest, the jeans, and the shoes from Ariat. Loving it. So let's start at the top. Hat, super warm under all of these lights, but it's so soft, y'all. I really like it. Um, it doesn't itch like in the back where the wool normally like hits your head, your neck. It doesn't itch. Thank God someone made a cute hat that doesn't itch. We love that. And the pom pom was just like, how can you not like that? And it's faux fur, so that's cool too. Uh, all right, on to the vest. So I've got it cinched in the back. It is a tie, so you can pull it up to the front and put it through this additional loop that's here if you wanted to. I just kind of like it tied in the back, give it a little bit more of a tailored look, but it runs plenty big. This is size small on me. Um, so if you did want to wear it a little bit looser, you definitely could. If you wanted to uh, tie it back a little bit tighter and have it more of like a a flow behind you type of thing. You could definitely do that. Um, but I liked it like this and it's super light. Love this for layering over a sweater um, or a long sleeve shirt for just kind of hanging out. It's super cozy. But I think it's also one of those things that is, um, you could dress it up a little bit if you wanted to. So if you wanted to wear it over a dress when we go back to offices, I think that you could. I think it would be really adorable. Um, and it also does button keep you a little bit warmer and it's got this really awesome like neck that you can push up if you want to be a little bit more like a uh, private eye or you can fold it down be a little bit more comfortable so it's definitely versatile and I like that in my clothes because you can have one piece that works well for a bunch of different things instead of having to have multiple things so I really like this and coupled with like how cute the back detail is that we showed you before can't go wrong all right Onto the jeans. So these are a 27 short, that is a six. They do run a tiny bit small, possibly due to the fact that they are the kind of like short cut. Um, so I would say if your wife is a size six or your girlfriend, kid, friend is a size six, maybe go with a size eight. Um, just size up. I think that's probably a good idea. Um, but they are, they feel really nice. They are a really thick denim. They are that two way stretch, so they feel really good. Uh, that premium Italian 
doing nice things. I really like the color. I think it makes my butt look good. I think the pockets are good enough size on the back. You can really get your hands in there and that's important. You got stuff to carry because ladies, we are tired of small pockets. Uh, but these are nice. You can fit your whole hand in there. I don't think you could fit a phone in there. Uh, but that's what the back pockets for and a cute purse. Um, what else? So we got a really large flare here at the bottom. So if you're not interested in like a real flare, I would say this might not be the, the jean for you, but if you are, these are the jean for you. I don't mind the, um, the rough edging. I don't think it looks bad at all. I think it's definitely a big flare. Even the 27 short is quite long on me. As you can tell, I am 5'2", and these jeans are still long on me. So perhaps I would wear these with like a little bit of a higher heel, make them like a super dress jean, something like that. Um, we're finally at the bottom. So we're at the shoes. These shoes are really comfortable. These have arch support. Arch support, y'all. As someone with flat feet who can never find a Western looking shoe that actually has arch support, I'm very excited about this. And they're also super light. So that bantam weight is not holding you down. Um, the heel is not super tall. So these are something you could definitely wear on your feet all day long. Just standing here, I'm like, huh, this is really nice. <laughs> I like it a lot. They're super comfortable. It almost feels like you're wearing um, like a flat or something. So ladies, if you wear flats, you know that it just kind of feels like there's like a small sole attached to the bottom of your foot. That's kind of what this feels like because they're so light and the sole is so thin. There's not really a ton going on here. There's not a ton of cushioning. There, it's not like the Fat Babies where there's like a platform or anything. And the sole bends super easily because it is just that like uh, plastic, plasticky rubber. So super easy to bend, move around, nothing is stopping you. They feel a little bit um, loose, but I am wearing super thin socks, not like boot socks or anything like that. So I think they'll be great for winter because there's plenty of room to put a thick, nice sock in there. We love it. Um, all right, so let's actually look at the boots. So when you look at the boot, you can see that stitching is super cool. Look how wide this elastic is, there's so much room. And the elastic actually goes all the way down to like mid calf, so it's not just that it's fitting in the top of your calf, but it's fitting in the entire calf, which I really like. All right, so that's kind of what it looks like when I tuck the jeans in. Obviously, this is a lot of material down here. You do all of this inside of this, but I think it still looks okay. Um, if I were to wear these, I could probably get away with them wearing them with a dress because they do fit my calf. They're not too constricting or anything like that. I think the color looks really cool. I think they fit a little bit big down here, which is a little bit kind of awkward, but I just gotta figure out how to style that. I'll figure it out. Um, but I like them covered with jeans. I've never actually had boots that I have liked enough to wear with jeans, so maybe these will be those boots. Um, but they fit my calf. We like that. They're super comfortable, super lightweight, very easy to move around in. All around, probably a great buy for $1.99. All right, Brenna, I think all your choices from the gift guide were awesome, especially these boots. Mm -hmm. I think these Heritage elastic calf boots are so cool. Yeah. Finally, it seems like wide calf boots are few and far between, so I'm happy to see that Ariat is offering that now. Me too. Honestly, me too. And the fact that they have a little bit of extra support in there and the sole is really lightweight and the heel isn't too high, it's like finally they're actually, and not just Ariat, but like finally boot makers are actually thinking about the person who has to wear the boots in the women's industry. Thank you, we love it. Okay, we love it. We're here for it. <laughs> if you guys are interested in checking out Ariat's gift guide, there's a bunch of stuff. Not only these four things that we covered today, but literally tons of stuff. Holes Links are in the description. And this holiday season, there's gonna be a ton of sales that Ariat's are gonna be doing too. So when this video is posted, they're doing sales, and I'm sure there's gonna be another one later on in the holiday season. So just because we named these prices doesn't mean that there might not be a chance for some percentage off. So keep that in mind. I wanna say huge thanks to Ariat for sponsoring this video, and also thanks to my beautiful wife, Brenna, for being the model and the reviewer for this video as well. <laughs> Seriously, guys, like this video for 
Brenna right now. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching today. Don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Peace, everybody. Have a good one. Let's go see what's inside Ariot's gift guide. Much more than boots is what we'll find for Christmas time. Thank you for watching today. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Let me know what you end up getting from the gift guide down in the comments. Peace. Have a good one.